still holds secrets. Every three days, a new species of animal is discovered. There are reports of Bigfoot and UFOs. Some believe that these secrets may have been known to ancient cultures. The ancient Egyptians hid symbols of these secrets in their architecture to preserve a record of their existence. When all these ancient civilizations died off, the task of safeguarding these hidden mysteries fell into the hands of the secret society known as the Freemasons. Their task was to keep these mysteries out of their own hands. If they didn't, it could spell certain doom for the whole world. Legend says that, in time, this conspiracy will be exposed, and all will be saved by the most unlikely of people. What was that about? No one was supposed to know we were meeting tonight. Now the hidden mystery could unravel and we could all be doomed! Everyone ashore! Let it go! Everyone, into the jeeps, now! Leave him, there's no time. They come back for him. Follow me! He is a ruthless man. The organization is evil. Where is he going? I don't know, but I'm sure he hasn't given up. There's too much at stake here. Someone's coming. How do they keep finding us? Keep up your guard! He's not slowing down! Get out of the way! Say, get to me! Don't jump to this way! I can't! We're gonna have to jump! One, two, three! <laughs> There's something I need to ask you, Charles. <gasps> ask away, my good man! I want you <laughs> to be Jonathan's <laughs> godfather. <laughs> My wife Kelly says that <laughs> she's going to do great things. <laughs> and I want you to take care of him. <laughs> I promise you'll watch over him. I will. <laughs> <laughs> I will look after you like you are my own. <laughs> Kendroy! No old sinister ran off into the woods! I think he was in on it! <laughs> It's certainly nice that you were able to get away and come on vacation with us, Lance. I wouldn't have missed the Festival of San Fermin for anything. Thanks for inviting me. 
Thanks for letting me tag along, too. By the way, what's happening here? Uh, you're kidding, right? It's the running of the bulls! What is so exciting about seeing a cattle drive? No, no, no. The bulls will be charging us. Mrs. Thunder is even going to get it on video. So the cows are going to make us pay with our credit cards to see them run by? How's that work? Getting out of hands! I'm starting to see why your dad calls him a boofhead. Here they come! Run for it, Mr. Digalot! Run towards- ah! I'm having a feeling that I shouldn't have worn red today. Phew! That was close. So, where are we? Oh, we're in the arena where the bull fights will take place later today. Will we be able to see them? Sorry, it's all sold out. I'm hungry. Let's go find some place to eat. Wait, where's Digalot? I knew I should have stayed at the museum. Sorry if I'm a little late. No worries, we weren't waiting. Oi! It can't be. Who? It's one of me old mates. Good eye, Dan. It's so good to see you again, mate. You're friends with Dan Brown? Oh, hi, Johnny. Is it possible that you've brought me a bigger fan than you, Johnny? I don't think you need to worry about that, Dan. This is my daughter, Sarah, and her boyfriend, Lance Spears. What brings you to Pamplona? You didn't run with the bulls, did you? Nah. That sport is more for the athletic type. I'm here giving a lecture about the so-called hidden mysteries. Oh, might. That's, that's very fascinating. Though it is all superstition, right? Oh, it's getting a little warm out here, Mike. We should go on inside. Would you care to join us, Dan? Sure. Jerry? Oh, I might. What are you doing here? I'm waiting for Jinx. We have some celebrating to do. What are you celebrating? You didn't hear? Jinx got a job at the Smithsonian. I think I just saw a flock of pigs fly over. Oh, I'm sorry you haven't heard. He got trampled by a bunch of bulls? Don't worry, he called me a little while ago, and he's okay. Just a little shaken. Besides, they can always get someone else to operate the simulator that. By the way, Dr. Kilroy wanted me to find you. What happened? He made a startling discovery. Yesterday, he was supervising an excavation in Newfoundland when he found a dead excavation worker. This was sitting next to him. Why, it's the Hand of Mysteries. This is part of what I'm lecturing about. The Hand of Mysteries? The Hand of Mysteries is an invitation to learn wisdom. The hand usually points towards a portal. Where was it facing? He sent me a text message that it was facing a door with the seal. So far, that excavation crew can't get it open. Well, what are we supposed to do now? I think we're going to go to Newfoundland and see what this is all about. Could you join us, Dan? Your knowledge would be invaluable. I wish I could go with you, but I had to complete my lecture series. If you need me, you have my number. What about me? Why, why, why? Don't you and James have to get back to uh, Washington? You know, to get ready for the new job and everything. You're right. Where is this dig? It is in Lance Oats Meadows. Don't you mean Lance O Meadows? Yeah, yeah, whatever. All right, mates. What are we waiting for? Next stop, adventure. Patrick, could you please stop reading over my shoulder? It's really annoying. But there's nothing else to do. There's plenty to do. You can play video games with Thomas, watch Jean practice lassoing cattle, sorry. I'll just stay here. You won't believe it. 
I managed to lasso the largest bull on the ranch in less than 30 seconds. Zooming Bucking Bessie? That is impressive. I hope it's no bull. That trick? Shut up. I'll be right back. I have to clean myself off. You know, I really like him. You do? John's so smart. He reminds me of his brother Billy. You mean the one who died of hate because he was too tough for his oxygen tank? What is it, Sammy? Sunny Thunder! Two days ago, the body of Howard Rose and the Hand of Mysteries was discovered at the Lance Os Medor National Historic Site. The authorities say that Dr. Charles Curie has identified that the hand was pointing towards a sealed plug. Intrapid adventurer Johnny Thunder has volunteered to investigate the murder and see if the plug can be removed. She is planning to set out tomorrow. Ah, did you hear that? Sounds exciting. This can only mean one thing. Treasure. I'll get the others. Sammy, there's someone at the door. You should talk to him. So find me. Who are you and what do you want? I am Psychic Steven Sever. I am here to help you find the treasure. How do you know we are looking for the treasure? Sammy, don't you ever listen. You said I was psychic. Stop calling me that. Go get Thomas. Uh, how do I know you're not one of Johnny's spies? What's all the racket? You're taking me away from Ghost Squad. Who's he? He's a psychic. Psychic, eh? Well, if you're psychic, prove it. Follow me. What's up with you? Blood makes me squeamish. If you let me, I will kill it for you. How will you do that without blood? Observe. <laughs> what was that? I just psychically killed that goat. Are you not impressed? You mean you used your mind to kill that goat? Absolutely. Now I'm convinced. Convinced? That was our oldest goat. It could have been just a normal heart attack, son. No. I know I was the one who killed that goat. You know? Yes. I could just feel it when our minds became one and I could control that goat, extracting its soul. Now he's starting to creep me out. Oh boy, oh boy! Can he go with us? Please, Samuel, please! So, why not? Oh, why do all the crazies keep finding me? This is Lord Sinister speaking. Captain Vladimir Sugar, reporting for duty, comrade. We for Newfoundland tomorrow. Gather the troops. Da, comrade. The next time you do that, it is the Gulag for you. Everyone gathers your things. We leave bright and early. Soon this mystery will be ours. <laughs> <laughs> Mysteries which points towards the seal, the Howard Rose, grandson of a good friend of mine, sometime in the middle of the night, was starved to death. I'm sorry, I didn't realize he was a friend of yours. His grandfather and I were then close in my earlier days. So, who bumped him off? The, uh, Crime scene report at this time states that the uh, cause of death was multiple stab wounds to the chest. Uh, we have no suspects at this time, unfortunately. Johnny, you showed up just in time. 
the priest had just given us permission to open it, obviously since the hand of mysteries was pointing towards this scene, it must be important. Get it so, get the check here. No, no, don't do that, Harry. You'll ruin the artifacts. We don't want to use explosives either, because that may cause structural damage. Maybe there's some type of a secret lever or device somewhere. Maybe it's on the door itself. After all, Dan said that the Hand of Mystery always points to a portal. There's definitely something here. Ah, uh, yes, it is an old lost script, but all it says is the Yellow Turtle Reads. Uh, what could that possibly mean? Maybe there's a yellow turtle hidden in there. Come again? Just an idea. Dad, do you still have some of that stationery? Sure, I've got plenty of paper on me. You never know, we need to write something down in... Oh, I'll say what you're saying. Stand aside, everyone. Why? I wonder where the first of these portal keys is located. I don't think we have to look far. There's more writing which says Stone Circle. Sounds like Stonehenge to me. I don't know though. This is a pretty vague clue. Could be referring to a lot of stone circles. Actually, Harry may be right. If you look at this engraving, it shows ritualistic dancing in the center of a circle of stone that resembles Stonehenge. According to recent finds, it may have very well been the site of rituals. I guess we know where to go then. Alright, let's pack up and tomorrow we'll head out to London to see if we can find the first portal cave. We need to let Comrade Sinister know what they are up to. So, this is agreed that you'll be paid double wages if you help me psychically find the treasure? It is agreed. If you pay him double what you pay me, isn't that double nothing still nothing? Patrick, shut up! Uh, sir, uh, Comrade Thunder... Just a minute. Thunder has appeared to have uh, uncovered something of uh, great importance. What did he find? We don't know, but he was all fired up to go to London. London is a big city. Where in London? Well, um, we are not sure at this time, Comrade Sinister. Ah, I see them now. They are on a red bird. No, no, a plane. They are going to... 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 there. To... Stonehenge. What does this mean? We've got him. Gather everyone up. Tomorrow, we head for England. Oh goody! I've always wanted to drive on the opposite side of the road. Patrick, shut up! So, what's the plan? Oh, I was thinking we could take a tour of us to Stonehenge. Look, Sarah, it's one of them famous Buckingham Palace guards. These guys are like a tourist for all on their own. Hello. I think your shoe's untied. Boo! Why don't you give it a try? Why did the elephant go to skin doctor school? He wanted to become a pachydermatologist. How did you do that? Everyone has a funny bone. Oh, of course they do, Sarah. Otherwise, they all would be completely useless, since the humerus is foreign straight to the upper arm. Well, looks like all rides here, mites. Sarah, what are you thinking about? Nothing much, really. I was just trying to figure out what we might be missing on this map. A lot's been on my mind recently. The murder, the treasure, you. Really? Get a room. Ah, ah. No, stupid. You blew our cover. 
Our shotgun! They'll take that. They got the map! Come on, after them! I think we should focus on finding the portal key right now. Without the map, we'll never find the portal key. Jump for it! They're too far to get from here. Then let's get closer. We're too late! Not if I can help it. Don't worry, I've got you. I'm going after them. Lance! Don't worry, I'll meet you at Stonehenge. Crocky, they're getting away! Time to improvise. You ain't getting away with this today, right? I beg to differ. We've lost the map! Don't worry. I'm sensing we'll have the key it leads to soon. Johnny, is that you? Yes, mate. I got the map. How are things going over there? Lord Sinister got away. We also lost the Lance. Nice! What do you mean you lost him? He said he'll meet us at Stonehenge. Then that's where we'll meet. I'm going there right now. There's not much here. Where could they have possibly hid the clue? Maybe underground? Then let's hope it was very far enough away so we can dig it up without anyone noticing. Yeah, I think someone might notice if we climb over this fence that says no trespassing and start digging up a UNESCO World Heritage site. Tony, does the map give us any clues? I'm not seeing any clues on here. I just thought of something. Dad, let me see the map. See here. On one side is a circle with five other circles surrounding it, each with an animal inside. On the other side is a series of circles, one inside another. It almost creates a ripple effect. There are some rectangular shapes running along some of the circles. Others are more askew than the rest. It might be a representation of Stonehenge. Oh, crikey, you're right! But we're no closer to the portal key. Actually, this may tell us where it is. If you look at these circles, they seem to radiate out of the center. In fact, a few of the circles are inside the animal's physical circle on the monument itself. Does that mean that the key is exactly in the center? It must. The only problem here is that if we look for it, we'll be trespassing. How are we supposed to uh, get in? If the other visitors see us, uh, we're gonna be in big trouble. One of us will have to make a distraction. But what should we do? I know. Woo, woo, woo! We got to get used to a manual shift. Ah! <laughs> if we didn't have anything important to do, I could watch this all day. Uh, I don't think that was supposed to happen. Hi, it gets the job done. Now come on, we haven't much time. If Lance is right, the key should be right here. I can't help but feel bad, you know, digging up a international landmark. Ice! We found it! I guess that's the yellow turtle. Oh, crikey. There goes my deposit. Yeah! Want a ride to the airport? I'll drive. This lamb pie is wonderful. It is one of the English blokes. Delicacy. Super Diary, page 164. Sounds like it refers to a book. But I've never heard of a book called Sukuba's Diary. Well, according to Google, Sukuba's Diary is one of 300,000 books discovered in Mali. Let me see what I can find here. There's a translation on uh, page 164. It's talking about visiting Great Zimbabwe to hide the uh, orange crab. Well, looks like we found our next destination. Oh, 
think I'll save this uh, one peanut for later. Uh, I don't want to get too full now. I can't wait. This is going to be so exciting. Obviously, he's never really traveled with this before. You learn. I'll be right back. Right, where are you going? You're just heading over to the currency exchange. In your currency. U.S. dollars. I'm out. Twenty. Here's your thirteen trillion three hundred eighty billion Zimbabwean dollars, sir. Ooh. Look what I got! Hmm, what's that going to buy? Well, I can Buy a bag of chips? They're 15000 a bag. And I thought airplane food was expensive. What airplane food? Actually, this is the result of hyperinflation. Did you know that the Zimbabwean dollar is one of the weakest currencies on Earth? In fact, one US dollar equals 669 billion Zimbabwean dollars. It's really a shame. Don't worry, Mike. They'll take your American money here. Um, we gotta get going to the Ambassador Palace Hotel. Look at these prices. Everyone here must live like kings. Ugh. Steven, so I don't suppose you know where they are going next? Sure. They're headed for the Ambassador Palace Hotel. That's impressive. You didn't even have to do that whole spasm thingy. Actually, I just heard them say it. So, what are we going to do now? I will slaughter them like pigs. And if you can't, Stephen here can kill them like goats. Patrick, shut up. They must not know we are here. I could sneak in like a ninja and steal information. You can do that? Where'd you learn that? Ninja mode. From Ghost Squad. Please? Fine. Go break a leg. Just get as much information as possible. What about the rest of us? We will do nothing. For now. When the time is right, we will ambush them. <laughs> <laughs> Wow, it's just so amazing to see Great Zimbabwe. In my earlier years, I studied the great mysterious tower that stands in the citadel. It was discovered by a German geologist, Karl Mach. It was believed to be the entrance to King Solomon's mines, but later archaeological work proved it to be false. It was quite an exciting time. I think it's just wonderful how excited you are to find the next bottle key. I turned around and you had all run off. Okay, I'm game. How are we supposed to find the second portal key? There has to be a clue, like the writing on the first key. Hmm, I don't see anything, unless... Dad, what did that page say exactly? I don't remember. Hold on, let me look it up. Today, I depart from Great Zimbabwe, leaving the orange crab. Yada yada yada. Hmm, okay. Generous people. Safekeeping of this sacred object. Ancient tomb of the kings. Ah! Oh, ah, oh, here we go. Uh, it will be guarded by, at its entrance, the one who never forgets, and at its resting place. The bringers of disease. Bringers of disease? Count me out. Hi, where do you think you're running off to? I'm not gonna succumb to any curses. Remember what happened in India? Harry, that was not a curse. The Scorpion Palace is rigged to collapse. Besides, I thought you were the war hero. Stop the green! We need to figure out the rest of the crew! The one who never forgets? That's easy. That's an elephant. Impressive. Yeah, it's amazing what you can learn from the 1960s Batman TV show. Maybe there's an elephant hidden around here. Oh my! So that's what this tower's for. Come on now. <laughs> I'm not going in there. 
I don't want to get sick. Me neither. I've already gotten poisoned once, and I certainly don't want to go through that again. Fine. You two stay here, and keep going. Everyone else, follow me. Thought this was a tomb for kings. I would think they'd get more respect than just being uh, tossed on the floor the way they are. Actually, I think these are the kings. The skeletons on the floor must be from the lower class populace. You think so? Certainly. After all, the door looked like it hadn't been touched for ages, so they can't be thieves. Hmm, for an airtight tomb, there's a lot of webs in here. Wait, I think there's something in the water. Let's see. Whoa, that could be a problem. How do we get across? Wait, wait, I see something across the lake. There's a switch on the other side. There's uh, just one problem. I know, it's on the other side. Now he's starting to sound scary. You could try whipping it, honey. I don't think there's a way to do that. Oh, I don't see any way across without getting wet. Unless... Unless what? Unless you're supposed to get wet. Oh, uh, a little cold, but uh, well, time to go across. Oh, this uh, looks a little unstable. Should be careful, though. I wonder what that part of the riddle means. The bringers of disease. Huh. Oh, crikey! Oh, crikey, did you see that? That roach was as big as a bloody kangaroo! I guess he's never been to Florida before. What's the big deal? It's just one cockroach. Sarah, if you don't learn anything else in life, then remember this. There is no such thing as one cockroach. Bugs! Let's get out of here! Ah! No! Don't do it! Go, go, go! Ink! A crack is my pants! We're trapped. The boats are running away! But what's scaring them? Come here, buggy woogies. Time to be some flap flumbe. Good thinking, Harry. Harry! You saved us from them creepy crawlies! No problem. Those pesky critters were no match for me. Did you get the portal key? We sure did, Mike. Here it is. This inscription says, Under the black castle of terrifying legend is the blood red shark. That wasn't very helpful. The word blood is in quotes. Maybe it's a castle from a horror tale? Perhaps a castle in Transylvania. After all, Several terrifying legends dealing with sucking blood come from Transylvania. But there are no shortage of castles in Transylvania. It's not narrowing the search much. The word black could help. Maybe it's Dracula's castle. Yes, I guess it could relate to Bran Castle. Supposedly, it was once Black Dracula's castle. I thought that whole Dracula thing was a legend. Nope. Vlad Dracula was an actual prince who lived in the 15th century. He is best known for his methods of execution, where he would impale his victims on poles. In fact, he used to dine next to fields of rotting corpses on poles. And I was worried about a little disease. Looks like it. Hiya! Surrender! I am like the shadow of the night. I am gone before my opponent realizes it. Then your opponents must have a really bad reaction time. We could shoot you right now. But the ninja's agile, swift, invincible. You cannot see me. Oh, I'm shaking in my boots. Are you uh, 
shaking in your boots now, comrade. Whoa. No more funny business. What does this portal key say? He'll never tell you. One last chance. Cooperate, then we might let you live. Charles, tell me what the writing on the key says. Charles, pretty familiar, aren't we? It's a long story. Sir, with all due respect, I'm pretty sure Thomas overheard what they were saying. Let's go see what he has to say. I may not need any of you. Doctor, why didn't you tell them what the key said? What would have been the use? At least they would have let us live. They're probably now going to come back with Captain Sugar. Sugar? Uh, you know, the muscly commander. Arr! Jim sure knows a lot about Lord Sinister's men. There's something fishy going on. Hey, you! What? Crocky, mate! Didn't see that one coming! I don't think he did either. Move aside, Johnny! Lord Sinister, we have an unforeseen problem. How are we going to get back to civilization? There should be a vehicle on this train. Someone needs to look for one. Sarah, Lance, go get to the vehicles. Goldrez, there they are, get them. Everyone else, let's hold them off. Hi, where's Harry? Right here. I thought these might come in handy. Don't tell me that you need Sweetheart, uh, you're really starting to worry, mate. Don't discount her too soon. Hi, where did he come from? I told you, I'm swift and invisible. I hate to disappoint you, but uh, we can see you. What? Do you think he's gone? Uh, no. All right, time to go. This is a dead end. We need to go back. Trouble, strangers. That's my line, you idiot. <clears throat> Look at what you got and done. I'm gonna have to teach you some manners. Where'd they go? I don't reckon I know, partner. Patrick, shut up. So long, comrades. We're doomed. Not unless we get out of here. Jump on! I'm jumping! Geronimo! Thank you. You saved us. Did you get our stuff? Yes, we did. We got lucky. It's in the crate on the back of the truck. Hi! What about the portal keys? They're still on the train. I've got to go back for them. No, no. Uh, it's too dangerous. Uh, we'll get them back and transfer them. I haven't even arrived at the castle yet, and I'm already getting the creeps. What is this place anyways? This is the Beata Safari, home of the council house. Built in 1420, this place was used to torture prisoners and burn alleged witches. Now I feel even more uncomfortable. I know how to cheer you up. Want a Dracula mug? No. How about a Dracula t-shirt? No. How about Dracula 3D bedsheets? Here, I want this. I can't believe I'm encouraging you by buying this. Come on, let's see where we need to head off to next. The only problem is, the clue doesn't give enough information to really help us. There must be a clue hidden in one of the local museums. Right inside here is the Brasov Historical Museum. Come on! Let's go check it out! Under the black castle of terrifying legend is the blood red shark. Does this clue really rely to the brown castle? In this picture, the castle is a grey colour, not black. I've got an idea. 
Maybe when twilight comes, the castle actually turns black as the legend says. Let's get up to the top of Mount Tampa this evening. We might be able to get a clear view of Braun Castle from there. If it really appears black as the clue suggests, I think we might have our answer. What will we do until then? We should definitely stay low. Lord Sinister knows about the treasure. And if that ninja really did overhear us, they'll know to come here. What do you suggest we do? We'll stay in town for now. However, if my hunch is correct, we'll need to be at the cable car station around 5 tonight. Here we go. Whoa, the view is amazing. Hey, speaking of which, Dr. Kilroy, what do you know about Transylvania? Did she just ask Dr. Kilroy to expound on something? Do you know that Blood Dracula certainly means the son of the dragon because his father was a knight of the Order of the Dragon? Also, a common art practice in Romania, where pictures are painted on glass and wood, is believed to keep evil spirits out of households. Hi. Hey, what's that buzzing noise? Where's it coming from? I have a creepy feeling about this. Um, I think we've got company. Today, you will see us demise than that. Uh-huh. Which one of these switches is the equivalent of the A button? That's how you're rambling about. And Microsoft Flight Simulator, the A button turns us left. I bet you're regretting the decision to not let me fly that part, you Sammy? Uh, I'm surrounded by idiots. I can't believe I'm saying this. Patrick, take the controls. <laughs> what are we going to do? One of us is going to have to drive them off. I'll do it. There's a ladder I can use to get on top of the cable car. But wish me luck. Oh, we're gonna go! It's just a scratch. Get focused! I'm gonna need some heavier firepower. How about this? You sure come prepared. Hey, you never know when you might see a vampire here in Transylvania. Seriously? You're joking, right? Do you want this or not? This'll even up the odds. Sugar. Drop below us. Ah! Where's the reset game button? It's called the jumping out. Follow my lead. Don't worry. I'll just respawn. Sugar, change places with me. Now's your mind, Thunder. Wow. Woo! Thanks, mate. Wow, that's quite a view. Brasov looks like it has a golden glow. Yeah, it really makes for a romantic evening. Oh, dang it! I was wrong. Wrong about what? Brian Castle is not a silhouette at dusk. Half of it's still bathed in light. Did we just hit a dead end then? No, we have to keep our minds open. What else could the clue be referring to? Hard to say. There's a lot of castles around here. Does it have to be a castle? Wait! That just gave me an idea! Of course! The Black Church! I should have known! What? Between 1384 and 1477, the Black Church was built as part of Piazza Sottololi. The church got its current name in 1689 when the inside was blackened from a fire, but it perfectly matches the clue. Besides the name, its gothic architecture makes it castle-like. Also, being located in a complex where prisoners were tortured and alleged witches were burned, it relates to a history of terrifying legend, especially since ghostly screams can be heard from the towers at night.
Oh boy, will this adventure ever end? That means we came up here for nothing? Not exactly. We know where to find the next key. Tonight, we will go to the Black Church and find the portal key. But first, I need to get one of those Dracula cell phone holders at the gift shop. Walls would be darker. The walls have been scrubbed down lately, removing some of the soot. Where do we go now? Maybe there's a covered hole under the floor. What did the riddle say? Under the black castle of terrifying legend is the blood red shark. There should be something here. Nothing. Wait! If you look here on the wall. The scrubbing has slightly revealed a picture of a castle. Below it is an X. Hand me one of those posts. Looks like we found it. This seems pretty easy. Maybe too easy. I don't see any traps of any sort. I wonder who these people were. I don't know, and I don't want to know. This might be a booby trap. Heh <laughs> always wanted to do that. Eh, why am I not surprised? I think we're in trouble. To the entrance! We're trapped! We've got to find a way out, otherwise we'll end up like Blood's victims. Will someone stop this madness? We're looking for a way out. Come on, let's get out of here. That was close. Well, I got the portal, okay? I wonder where we're heading off to next. Go to the Rainforest Spine. Where you will find a city divine. This city of the peak has a, a temple with three windows which you seek. Hmm. You will find the gift that prickles you saw. Give it to the one who guards the door. That one is pretty explanatory, I think. Yes, I believe that it points to Machu Picchu. After all, it does have the Temple of the Three Windows, and it's in the Andes Mountains, making it a city of the peak. Then let's go. Stephen, your sixth sense has not failed us. They are here. I also sense they're headed to Machu Picchu. I have a close ally that we can meet up with there. Then let's follow them. Okay, go. Why not? I was working on a muffler, but I got really exhausted. Patrick, shut, shut up! up. Try it again, Harry. According to the map, the temple of the three windows is just up this hill. We're almost there. Where's the one that guards the door? It must be somewhere else. Maybe there's a clue up here. You mean like this one? Is that what I think it is? Yes, it's a map that marks the site of a statue. Map says that the statue, assuming it is a statue, is... Hmm, what is it? It's hard to see, but it appears to be located inside one of those dwellings over there. That means the riddle was a false clue? No, no. It's just worded that way, so explorers would be misguided. There's just one thing, though. 
What do they mean by what prickles you soul? Maybe it refers to some sort of sharp point. You're saying that it may be a cactus? What other sharp things existed when the culture was flourishing? Stone weapons? Maybe. Let's go take a look. Crikey! Sorry, senor. Excuse me, but we're looking for a statue. Have you by any chance seen it? A statue? Uh, yes. I saw one on the way over here. Can you take us there? Si. Senor? Cabarro. Ah, yes. I'm Hurricane, and I speak quite a bit of Spanish myself. Maravilloso. Siempre es bueno cuando extranjeros aprenden mi lengua. Lo aprendió cuando estaba chico o ya de edad. Huh? Here you go. Thank you. De nada, señora. I think Lance might be on to something about the cactus. But I'm not sure what to do with it. Maybe you need to set it in his outstretched hands. Well, let's give it a try. Dios mío, what's going on? A secret door must be opening up. Come on, let's go. Honey, are you sure we should just run inside? Remember what happened in Zimbabwe? Yeah, Dad. We were all buried alive by insects. You're right, you're right. Harry, you and Jim, go in and check things out. Why us? Because you two didn't almost get buried alive. Ah, very funny. Okay, everyone follow me. We'll be more careful this time. Fuck! Shh! Everyone, turn on your flashlights. We don't know what's in here. Rots. Why did it have to be rots? Look at all of this vegetation. It's so hard to believe that all of this can exist without sunlight. Thanks for the insight, but personally, it creeps me out. What do you mean? I don't know. It's just that I'm getting the feeling that it's watching us. Don't be silly. Plants don't have eyes. Now come on. Well, we could look on the bright side. The plants have effectively uh, neutralized uh, any traps that may get in our way. Well, where to now? We're underneath the central plaza. Therefore, the portal key should be ahead. Then let's go. Ah! Johnny, watch where you're going. Oh, I'm fine, I'm fine. Wait, where'd that branch come from? Oof. Sarah, are you alright? Don't worry, I'm fine. Wait, you aren't moving right now. You're right. Something's wrong here. I told you, I don't know about you guys, but I'm getting out of here. Oh no, you're not going anywhere. You saved an entire division. Squad. Whatever. Anyway, if you saved an entire squad, I think you can handle a few plants. Oh, uh, senora, this is not your ordinary houseplant. Of course, it must be a carnivorous plant. Did you know? You have got to be kidding me. Now is not the time for one of your lectures. Oh yes, of course. This is far worse. Crikey! Uh, it's all around us! How are you got you? How are we going to kill this thing? Does anyone have a bazooka? I believe a bazooka in this situation is as appropriate as one of my lectures. Try to aim for the roots! He's got to have some weakness! Get the shovels, we'll dig it out. Are you nuts? We'll be dead before we even get near it. Well, do you have another solution? Oh, that's it! The only reason that this beast can survive without light is with moisture. We just need to dry it out. But how do we dry it out? Remember what you used to make flambe back in Zimbabwe? Throw the torch, mate! Here I go! It's working! This is quite the campfire. Anyone got any marshmallows?
there it is. No one dare approach you, treasure. So says a tree. Bless you. Do you need a tissue? Oh, sorry if I offended you. I didn't mean it. He who wishes to get the treasure must complete the secret trap. I use it to limbo. I can do that any day. How old is this? Well, what's the answer? Honestly, I am confused by this question. I don't know if he's referring to Machu Picchu or these tunnels. Neither. Neither? What could he be talking about? Yes, all of us have it. Yet we don't know it. I've seen it before in the vision. You are the one sent to this. Isn't wisdom considered timeless? You are wise, young one. The treasure is yours. Hi, White. How did you figure that one out? I don't know. I kind of just knew it. Now let's get the red portal key. Which is, um... Where is the red portal key? Oh, it must be with the extra supplies I left at the entrance. What? Someone stole the portal key. Did you see anyone with a sack? I saw a man dressed all in white with the sack running toward the river. Dios mío! What is it? Señor Palomar, the notorious crime boss, was here. He must be working for Lord Sinister. Oh, uh, what should we do now? If it helps, I heard him mention an airstrip to the men he was with. I've got a boat on the river. I can take you there. Then let's go. If Lord Sinister was to meet up with Senor Palomar, he would probably be along the river. I don't see them. This is exactly what happened in Vietnam. We were just cruising along in our PT boat when Shazam! Them Charlie sprang out of the bushes like an angry bear. Enough with your war stories. We've got to get the other keys back. Wait! What? I don't hear anything. What's so weird about that? Exactly! There isn't a sound. Not even any animals. This couldn't possibly be good. It's you, Senor Palomar! Caparo! Senorita, before I go, there is one thing I must do. I'm listening. You cannot trust what I go on. You have a traitor amongst you, Senora. This one has connections to a secret organization. One that must be stopped. What are you talking about? This. These people want you all dead to carry out their muy mal deeds. Look. Kabaro? Kabaro! He's dead. We've got to get those keys. Don't let them get away. Can't this Uncle Steel go any faster? Stop driving like your mother and just go! Actually, my father's not here to drive. Patrick, shut up! Their history. It's such a bad shot. It's even a wonder you can send. That is not how you talk to a superior, Rudolph. Now get moving before I test my vehicle. I'm going for the yellow key. Rudolph, take care of him. I'll take over the man. I've got it. Uh, I'm going to get the other two keys. Sarah. You're in my way. You're in Hey, let's jump the Vladimir sugar to you. Yeah, yeah. Anyway, get rid of her. Oh, I am just getting started, comrade. I'm no friend of yours. Oh. Oh no! Ugh. 
They're getting away with Sarah and Lance. Now, save them. Looks like this year's crop will be great thanks to Miracle Grow. Anything will grow with Miracle Grow. My corn! This fight's really corny. Patrick, shut up! I have you now, Senor. Yeah, but Shooks, he's got the steering wheel. So long. Comrade. I told you, I'm not your friend. Oh! Lance, get in! Get in! Oh no! What is it? Sarah has been captured! Crikey, we need to get her back! Not today. <gasps> what? We can't let them take her! We may never see her again! How did you do that? Thanks, guys. I wouldn't have believed it if I hadn't seen it myself. Those Peruvian monkeys sure are friendly and talented. Eh, I owe George Lucas an apology. I'm just glad to have our little girl back. Aw, Mom. And now we have the blue and yellow portal keys. What's our next destination? The Great Barrier Reef. The writing on the key said the next key is written with the scaled guardian of the reef's secrets. There's a map, too. Scaled guardian? They saw spell a certain deal. I'm sure it's not as bad as it sounds. Come on, we have to find the next key. But what about Lord Sinister? I don't know why, but I have a feeling he knows where we're going. We'll worry about him later. She's all ready to go! Then let's get going. Hi. There's nothing like being home. Let's go inside and eat. I'm starving. Are we going out after this to find the key? No, it's too late. Besides, we need diving equipment. Don't worry. Since Lance has some experience, he can go rent the diving suits and boat. How many suits do we need? I don't need one. I'm getting too old for undersea adventures anyway. I mean, neither do I. I'll be manning the boat. I'll stay with Harry and Dr. Kilroy. So, we'll only need four suits. Here comes the food. I'm starved. Sorry, but it's a little cramped at this table. Honey, why don't you and Sarah join me? Um, sure thing. What's the matter? Something bothering you? Back on the boat in Peru, Gabaro said that there was a traitor amongst us. He also said that the traitor was working for a secret organization that was plotting to do something terrible. A secret organization? Which one? He didn't say. All he said was, The horror! The horror! You mean like in Heart of Darkness? Yes. I was also thinking about what Archie said about setting forth prophesied emotions that would affect the entire world. I wonder if the two are connected in some way? So what you're saying is that every step that we make on this adventure will affect the entire world as we know it. How is that even possible? What do you mean? I mean, I've seen a lot of crazy things in my life. Heck, I've seen you come back from the grave, but I'm an archaeologist, not a god. You never know, Dad. Just in these last few days, I've seen some things that I've never thought possible. Maybe your discovery will bring change. And so it shall, Dr. Thunder. Okay, we're almost ready to launch off. Alright, let's get final preparations underway. I'll make sure the oxygen tanks are good. Everything's good on the boat. Everything's good. Alright, I guess we're ready. 
Oh, I hope everything turns out well. Don't worry. In due time, it all will. If the map is right, we should be over the X right now. Let's get ready. Trey's all ready to go. Do you see anything? Nothing unusual. Let's get in closer. Is that it? I'm not sure. This seems a little too easy. Yeah. I remember the last time I said that. Ready your spear guns. I got it! Do you see anything? Nothing so far. I think it's safe to say we can head for the surface. <laughs> I'll laugh if this isn't what we're looking for. Crocky! What was that? It was probably just a school of fish. Whatever it was, we need to get back to the surface. Uh, that's going to be harder than we think. Crocky! It's a blue wind sea monster! Let's get to the surface now! I can't breathe! I've got you. How did that happen? Jim was just checking the- oh, oh. oh no. I think I know who murdered Howard Rhodes. What does that have to do with the price of tea in China? Actually, Chiang Wu's revolution affected the price of tea in China more than this ever will. But this, this explains everything. See, I told you you would get to see the other portal keys again. Speaking of portal key, bring up that chest. Let's get this thing open. Ah, uh, looks like the editor is dying. <laughs> now we know where to go. This is why you never trust a Sicilian when death is on the line. What? I'm not Sicilian. Sorry. Something I heard in a movie once. Ugh. I was wondering, but how did you figure out Jim was working for Lord Sinister? Oh, it's, it's rather simple when you think about it. When Jim said he was checking oxygen tanks, I'd already checked them off. They are all ready to go. He must have sabotaged them. That's why Sarah's oxygen level was so low. Also, didn't you think it was rather odd that he knew an awful lot about Lord Sinister's men, and was in a hurry to get everywhere, even after Sarah had been captured? He wanted to leave her behind! Thank goodness for those monkeys, then. I have a question, though. Why did Jim kill Mr. Rhodes? Oh, Mike, that's easy. He wanted me involved. He knew that if he killed Howard, I couldn't stay away. Just like when Robert Teabing killed Loxonia. Well, Johnny, you certainly have always been the clever one. What's so important about this find? For me, it's my life's work. After my three brothers were killed in Vietnam, I wanted world peace. My approach was to study ancient civilizations and what many call the hidden mysteries. One organization kept popping up, the Club of Rome. They had been searching for these mysteries for centuries. Hey! I read at the library that they have some connection to the whole Illuminati conspiracy. Shh! Or he may have to kill you. Is Mui secret? Well, too late. I guess the secret's out. Anyway, where was I? Australia. You know I could just kill you right now. Eh, I didn't say anything. As I was saying, at my first meeting, I met prestigious scientists, industrialists, and economists. They discussed different ways to bring about peace. A scientist proposed a plan that was guaranteed to work. First, we would cover up media coverage of new technology, including UFOs. What? You've built UFOs? No, no. My fellow scientists did. Anyway, if anyone saw these UFOs flying around, we would just tell everyone that the aliens were coming to use their ray guns to turn your insides into jelly. 
If one happened to crash, we would cover up the evidence. So, all your society does is tell people that aliens are invading? Well, no. The world is also divided up into ten regions, which is each controlled by a different member. There they make wars start, and assassinations happen. But, wait! That doesn't make any sense! Thought you were after world peace. I'm not done yet! Ah, give me some more punch. As we add chaos to the world, people will want peace more and more. Then, our plan launches. We will have actors posing as space aliens land on Earth in one of our experimental UFOs and bring a message of peace. Then they will say to follow their orders or face extermination. Then, through a world dictatorship, peace will be achieved. There is only one thing in the way. The hidden mysteries. Uh, how can mysteries topple a world government? It is said that these mysteries are so powerful, they will change the way we think forever. What do you mean, exactly? These hidden mysteries will give man power thought only to be magic. So, I was sent out by the Club of Rome to find these hidden mysteries and destroy them. However, after two decades, I was no closer to the mysteries. That's why I used the murder to pull you into this, Dr. Thunder. Now, a world dictatorship is almost here, and no one will stop us. There's just one more question. How did Lord Sinister know where we were all the time? That's easy. Steven's psychic. No, he's not. That's impossible. He killed a goat with his mind. I just got lucky that the goat died of a heart attack. I knew where Johnny was all the time because Jim and I have two-way communication. That means Steven's in on this too? Yes. So is Senor Palomar. Stephen was there just to get Lord Sinister moving. I have been promised wealth beyond my imagination, and I have quite an imagination. Oh, I almost forgot your cut of the bargain. We're going to be arriving on Easter Island in a few hours. Get ready, because the world as you know it is about to end. <laughs> Is a treasure. Well, apparently, we need to go along this beach for some time before we get anywhere close to where the treasure is located, Mike. Is that all you could give for directions? Actually, I think he's right. If you look at the statue's eyes, they seem to be looking that way. They're looking the other way now. We must have missed something. Let's go back. They're looking back again. Dios mio, is this some sick trick? Let's go back again. Well, I think we're supposed to go inside of this clip. How are we going to do that? Maybe there is a clue somewhere around here. Let's take a look. Remember, no tricks. Not talking about the cereal. Uh. Hey, I found something! It looks like some sort of keyhole. What do we put in it? It looks like it's meant for one of the portal keys. Johnny, try the green one. We're almost there. Come on, we don't have a minute to lose. Human, stay out here and guards our backs. Ooh, look! Treasure! Is it the hidden mysteries? No, well, it's just a ring. There's an inscription. Whosoever removes this ring from my finger will die a horrible and painful death. Ah! I've been cursed! Oh, that's horror. Get moving. There are far more important things that need to be done today.
Johnny, from here on out, you know what to do. Get me the hidden mysteries. Well, I'm gonna need those photo keys. Now, what order do they go in? What's the problem? Johnny, why don't you use the rubbing from Newfoundland with the circles containing animals? Don't take all day. What are you waiting for? An engraved invitation? Don't worry, he has it under control. He did it. All who enter with greed in their hearts will be destroyed. But those with unselfish love will be rewarded. Ah, there it is. I see it. It is the stone of the hidden mysteries. Dios mio, have you ever seen such wealth? Ha <laughs> ha ha, it's more than I thought. Possible. Ooh, pretty lights. That trick? Shut up. Sarah, go help your father bring out the hidden mysteries. And... If we decide not to? What do you suppose the hidden mysteries are? I didn't see anything they were talking about. When you looked into the portal, what did you see? Lamps and I with two young children, one boy and one girl. Do you think it shows our future? It can't! I, I saw my father in there. Oh! Dad? Turn around. D Dad? Is that really you? Yes. A phantom of sorts. Listen, we don't have much time. The portal shows your innermost desires. That's not good. We're supposed to bring out Jim's vision of the hidden mysteries. If we don't, he's gonna kill Pippin. I, I can't deal with this anymore. Fear not. I can see what he sees, and feel what he feels. This gem will not last long in the outer world. Take it and go! But... I've got so many questions! Now is not the time. Go! And it is my honor to have finally met you, Sarah. Ah... <sighs> you may keep Lance around. He's... He's just alright. This has been amazing, Grandpa Daniel. Wow, it's more beautiful than I ever imagined. Orders are to destroy it. Change of plans. If the Club of Rome, and more importantly I, have these powers, we'll be able to control the world. That's not the plan. I said there's been a change of plans. What about what's owed to us? <coughs> they are silenced, just like Daniel Thunder and Gabarro. Did you kill my father? No. That was his honor. Say. I never claim to be an honorable man. They offered me one million dollars. But the collision is what killed him. My man was remote controlling the car. But what I lost that day was worth much more. A friendship? No. They still owe me for the hands I lost that day. That is why I went off on my own and have since had nothing to do with the club. Too bad, Sinister. Today, all of you helped me become the most powerful being in the universe. Johnny Thunder, what is the meaning of this? It's been returned to its proper place. Really? My boy, you have to retrieve it yourself in order for it to stay in your possession. Is that you, Billy? What's happened? Billy? Is that you? Sammy! Look, it's Billy! Oh, goody. Dad? Yes, my son. Are, are, are you alive too? I only have a brief time left, but all will be well now that my work here is done. Your work? The Illuminati, who are blind, was destined to destroy them. So they tried to eliminate us. First, by killing me, 
to end by trying to kill him. But they have not succeeded. What about the rest of the Illuminati? Do not concern yourselves with that. It will all be resolved. I am so proud of you, Jonathan. My son. You've done so much good for the world. I'd, uh, hate to disappoint you, but I haven't done that great of a job. You lead a wonderful woman happy. You mix the daughter together with love. There's nothing greater than that. I love you so much, Jonathan. I love you too, Dad. But before you leave, what are the hidden mysteries? It is one belief that each ancient civilization believed. Greed will destroy the world, while unselfish love and understanding would bring peace. The portal is a representation of this. That is why Jim Cobra's greed destroyed him, while John Parker's unconditional love for his brother saved him. Too bad the world doesn't fully understand this belief. It's up to you, Sarah, to show the world the virtues of love and charity. Goodbye, Grandpa Daniel. Hurry, the cave's collapsing. Everyone out of the cave, now! Well, it looks like this adventure is just about over. Looks like Lord Sinister and his men have disappeared once again. I'm sure he'll be back next time. In that case, it looks like it's time to head home and tell everyone about our discovery. This will certainly be a new beginning for all of us. Not just that. With the hidden mysteries uncovered and the Illuminati unmasked, this will be a new beginning for everyone. Come on, let's go home as a new era in history dawns. But the troubles are far from over, Johnny. <laughs> I'll show him who's a tough cowboy. Not as tough as me. Ugh. Well, the could be worse. There you are, Sammy! Me and my big mouth.
pity I can't find our backpack anywhere. I think we left it on Easter Island. Eh, that's okay. We'll buy a new one.